The big banks have to stop. It's not fair to the, their customers. North Carolina Attorney General Josh Stein calling on the country's largest banks to eliminate overdraft fees on consumer accounts. Overdraft fees end up costing working families incredible amounts of money. It can actually drive people into a financial hole. In 2020, the Financial Health Network found that Americans were charged more than $12.4 billion in overdraft fees, the average around $30 per occurrence. And the banks do this because they make a ton of money. In Charlotte, some banks have addressed the call to eliminate these fees. During the pandemic, Ally Bank announced it would temporarily end overdraft fees, but then extended the policy indefinitely. While Bank of America is still charging customers $35 when they overspend the balance in their account, the bank says it is reducing the fee to $10 starting next month. Ending yeah. these overdraft fees is the right thing to do for their customers because it's just a way of taking money from the people who can afford it least. And a lot of the big banks have already put an end. And it's time for all of the banks to do the right thing by their customers and stop taking financial exploitation of them. According to Truist Bank's website, customers are charged $36 for overspending their account balance. Wells Fargo charges $35 per item. In January, the bank announced a 24-hour grace period would become available by fall. Reporting in Charlotte, Taylor Young, Queen City News.